the space rock that wiped out most of the dinosaurs was one of the most devastating things this Earth has seen. Some 70% of life on Earth perished, and an asteroid impact almost surely played a role. Not all dinosaurs died out 65 million years ago. Avian dinosaurs and other words birds survived and flourished. Scientists at the American Museum of Natural History estimate there's more than 18,000 species of birds alive today. Many people the world over are allegedly seeing a prehistoric relic. A bird described by witnesses as being as big as a light aeroplane and looking like a pterosaur was recently seen. News of the giant bird broke after it was witnessed by a pilot, his passenger and a bulldozer operator on the ground. It was previously spotted by villagers in the remote southwestern corner of Alaska. One witness who saw the creature said the following, I have no idea what it is. I was sitting in my garden when I saw a giant shadow pass over. I looked up and saw what looked like a flying reptile. It was a very clear day and I didn't recognize it to be a native bird. This creature had a crest on its head and veiny wings. It was silent and flew off as quickly as it came. This isn't the only sightings of an alleged pterosaur. On September the 25th, 2001, a 19-year-old driving along Pennsylvania's Route 119 reported what he described as flags flapping in a thunderstorm coming from above his car. When he looked up, he was astounded to see what looked like a bird with a three to four meter wingspan and a strange elongated head flying above him. Over the next few months, two more witnesses reported seeing similar creatures in Greensville, Pennsylvania. The reports were reminiscent of a string of sightings that took place in Texas in 1976 and 1982. In all cases, the creature described sounded remarkably similar to a pterosaur. The sightings in Texas even occurred near to where the fossils of Quetzalcoatlus, a large pterosaur of the late Cretaceous, was first discovered. Interestingly, these pterosaur sightings seem to occur close to each other in waves. That suggests that people were really seeing something. But there may be a creature responsible. One obvious candidate is the frigate bird, whose grey feathers can look like leathery skin from the right distance, and whose wingspan can reach up to 2.5 meters. The frigate bird hardly ever lands except to tend to its young, and can soar over long distances. So what do you think these people are seeing? Do you think that a small colony of these creatures exists somewhere? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.